Now you were questioning the foam free, certified foam free sticker on there. Yeah. We've said this many times, uh, but Jerry didn't get that memo. <laughs> when an organ from the factory was built from 1955, a B3 or C3, until 1964, they used felt to hold as a retainer the very fine wires. There's nine fine wires that go to every key. But then somebody had the brilliant idea to use foam instead of felt. It didn't require uh, ret riveting, and there was some cost savings anticipated. And it probably was a good idea for maybe the first 20 years or so. Yeah, so for the next 10 years, from 1964 to 1974, they put this foam material in there. However, it starts to decompose with heat and humidity and thereby cause a chemical reaction with the fine wires. So you can start missing tones. Now we caught this one early and were able to remove the foam and it's possible we didn't have to make any repairs to the wires or maybe one wire had to be repaired. I can't remember exactly. All I know is that every note plays on every drawbar as it should and having foam in there will never be a problem for the future so we put a little label here and inside the back which says certified foam free and frankly it's a big deal uh, the fact that we're addressing the problem and being proactive so that these organs can be still playing strong in a, when they're 100 years old. I'll go as far as to say 200 years. Beyond that, we don't 
warranty. <laughs> beyond 200 years. But look at the age of a Stradivarius violin. But Stradivarius violin is the finest violin ever made, according to most people. They're 375 years old. So what we're trying to do here, Jerry, is preserve these Hammond organs, which are now 50, 60 years old average. We're trying to preserve them for the future. So that when a church like yours buys one, they don't have to worry about foam in the keyboards because they got it from Keyboard Exchange Internet. <laughs> well, we're going to wrap this up for now, but um, we have been blessed today by Cherry and his family. And, uh, and you've seen them all on, on this video or a similar video. And uh, God bless you all. Any final concluding words there, Jerry? Not at all. None at all? I said it all, did I? You said it all. <laughs> Thanks a lot for your time and attention, folks. Thanks for watching our video, and thank you also for uh, helping keep the Hammond Tone Wheel B3 organ alive. We couldn't do all this work that we do here without you. And it would also help greatly if you could subscribe, like, uh, ask for notifications for when we have new videos. That would be a big help for us. So we thank you once again. I'm signing off for now, but we will be back.